All right, so this is a vintage Fender fretless precision bass. Now, here's a headstock decal on it. All right, here's the serial number on it. But it has this anodized plate that might be either really old or reissue. I think it might be really old because this right here is kind of a brown. It looks original to the plate. This tone pot right here it has a date code that tells me that it's probably pretty old. Um, but what they did was they possibly put one of the, well, it's a replaced jack, um, replaced one of these. Then these have Allen wrench heads in them. first guitar from was telling me that uh, today's guitars you know that are five and ten years old are tomorrow's vintage guitars so if you have something cool like this and it's 20 years old man don't go drilling it or, or putting in you know stuff that doesn't belong on it if it's 20 years old, it should be grandfathered into where you don't mess with it. So this is a pretty cool bass. Know how to play I don't know how to play bass so but it's still pretty cool let's see there's a neckline now see what I would do it looks like it can be done I should probably drop this action a little bit because I like my action to be uh, let's see oops wrong straight you can shred on it anyways but there there is room in this on this bridge I just pulled this out of the case I got it put it away in the room it has a badass bridge on it and I haven't really peeled it out until now so it's very cool it is a I think like a 73 I think the plate dates it to a 73 but the electronics aren't original. I don't think the plate's original. I think the neck is. But uh, it's pretty cool. I would take this out. You can hear it brings a little, little more treble to it.
That's what it is. It's got a little bit of wear on the back. The neck has a few little dings on it. Nothing bad though. Let's see, here's a little ding that isn't too huge. And here's another one. I'll make a detailed video of it. But it's a, it's a seven, early 70s vintage. Vintage early 70s fretless precision bass. Thanks for checking it out.